It's the calm before the storm right here. Wait, how was I gonna start this off? I forgot. Oh yeah. That's an awfully hot coffee pot. Should I drop it on Donald Trump? Probably not, but that's all I got till I come up with a solid Got a plan and now I got a hatchet like a damn Apache with a tomahawk. I'ma walk inside a mosque on Ramadan and say a prayer that every time talks, she gets a ma- Ah! I'ma stop. But we better give Obama props cause what we got in office now's a kamikaze that'll probably cause a nuclear holocaust and while the drama pops and he waits for shit to quiet down he'll just gas his plane up and fly around till the bombing stops. Intensity's heightened, tensions are rising. Trump when it comes to giving a shit, you're stingy as I am. Except when it comes to having the balls to go against me, you hide them. Cause you don't got the nuts like an empty asylum. Racism's the only thing he's fantastic for. Cause that's how he gets his rocks off and he's orange. Yeah, sick tan. That's why he wants us to disband cause he cannot withstand the fact we're not afraid of Trump. Walking on eggshells, I came to stomp. That's why he keeps screaming, drain the swamp, cause he's in quicksand. It's like we take a step forwards, then backwards. But this is his form of distraction. Plus he gets an enormous reaction when he attacks the NFL, so we focus on that. And instead of talking Puerto Rico with gun reform for Nevada, all these horrible tragedies and these border would rather cause a Twitter storm with the Packers. and says he wants to lower our taxes, then who's gonna pay for his extravagant trips back and forth with his fam to his golf resorts and his mansions? Same shit that he tormented Hillary for and he slandered, then does it more from his endorsement of Bannon, support for the Klansmen, tiki torches in hand for the soldier that's blackened, comes home from Iraq and is still told to go back to Africa, forking a dagger in this racist 94 year old grandpa who keeps ignoring our past historical deplorable factors. Now if you're a black athlete, you're a spoiled little brat for trying to use your platform or your stature to try to give those a voice who don't have one. He says you're spitting in the face of vets who fought for us, you bastards. Unless you're a POW who's tortured and battered cause to him you're zeros cause he don't like his war heroes captured. That's not disrespecting the military. That this is for Colin, ball up a fist and keep that shit ball like Donald the bitch. He's gonna get rid of all immigrants. He's gonna build that thing up taller than this. Well, if he does build it, I hope it's rock solid with bricks. Cause like him in politics, I'm using all of his tricks. Cause I'm throwing that piece of shit against the wall till it sticks. And any fan of mine who's a supporter of his, I'm drawing in the sand a line. You're either for or against. And if you can't decide who you like more in your split on who you should stand beside, I'll do it for you with this. The rest of America stand up. We love our military and we love our country, but we hate Trump.